Hello and thanks for watching. My name is Joe Benjamin, the Empowerment Guy. Welcome to the third episode of the JB Show. It's week number three and in this episode I'm going to share with you the success strategy for the week as well as show you something. We're just going to do something a bit different this week and I'll tell you why. The success strategy of this week is in order for you to make a difference, you need to be different. I know you're going to ask me, how can I be different? The only way to be different is to be yourself. Be what you are. Everyone was made different. Everyone was made unique with a different purpose and a different talents and different callings. So if you become yourself, you will be different from everybody else. The problem that we're having nowadays with many people is people want to copy other people and you end up losing your own identity, you end up losing your own passions, your own dreams. But if you strive to become the best you can ever be, you will be different from the rest. Have you ever noticed that those people that are the true leaders, genuine leaders, do something differently from the rest of the crowd? Be different if you want to make a difference. Today's episode is going to be really different. We're not going to be taking a question, but I just want to show you something real quick. Right, I just want you to follow me to this place. It's a very quiet place, a very uh, lonely place. Now, if I was to ask you, are you ready to die? Would you like to die? I'm sure the answer would be no. But you see, the thing is, you need to ask yourself, why are you leaving? Why are you alive? Let me take you to this place, and I just have a point I want to make about being in a place like this. The reason why I'm here is to make a profound point. You know, in the life of a person, there's two important dates. The first date is the date that they were born, and the second date is the date that they die. Now, in between the two dates, there's a little dash. Now, when you look at your life, think about it this way. What would you like to feel that dash in between the day you were born and the day you die? What inscription would you like to see on your epitaph? What would you like to see written on your tombstone when you die? When you know what you'd like to be inscribed on your tombstone, then you can work from that. If you know what you'd like to be written on there, you want to start today to start doing those things that you'd like to see inscribed when you die. You see, when you die, all the ideas that you have will die. When you die, all the goodness within yourself will die. All the talents, all the gifts that are within yourself will die. So why wait till you die? Use those things that God has given you to bless somebody today. See, so the lesson we learn from this, the lesson I learned from this is, is life is too short. You've only got one life. Live that life to the fullest, to the maximum. Leave your purpose. Start making a difference. And do what you were born to do.